This project was founded to address the needs of our OPA members. We sent a proposal requesting a budget from the VOICE project after discussion and consultation from HelpAge Cambodia. We worked to reduce discrimination of the elderly, especially elderly and disabled women, through capacity building by representative groups and advocating for their rights. We have collaborated with seven federations to implement the project in 156 villages. We have worked with the association and other organizations. We have attended meetings with the commune and district team to share about the needs of elderly and disabled women. We also have attended the meeting of the national networks to discuss the plan basic needs in receiving community services. We organized a plan to implement this project. We first analyzed the goals and objectives of the project. Next, we researched how the OPA can prevent violence against older women while protecting their rights. Then, the OPA committee promoted the program to their members, especially to vulnerable older women and older women with disabilities. We visited the women in their homes to hear their experiences. We also organized events for elderly women on the International Day for Older Persons and World Health Day. Achievement. 200 OPA members received training and we promoted the program to 5,712 people, including 57% women. The OPA has integrated the plan with the commune and local levels. We have the ability to implement the project using and managing money well by ourselves. Health centers have agreed to instruct members on basic health care for the elderly. Successfully lobbied the Ministry of the Interior for an exempt tax and registration of OPAs and OPA federations. My husband didn't respect or listen to my ideas before joining the OPA. After joining the OPA, he changed day by day and now he asks my advice before making any decisions. Before, I was afraid to talk back to my husband, to reject him when he took my jewelry to sell or fight me. From now on, I realize that everybody has their own rights and that's why he mustn't do this to me again and I don't have to feel afraid anymore. As a project manager and member of the subcommittee, I really understand well on managing the project, money, activities, and the result. This program gives opportunities to elderly, both the doer and receiver, to know clearly about the rights and what they should get. Uh, Manusia, Tai sakadang nampol lebah pukat dek kuket dong.